Percy Jackson and the Olympians, The Lightning Thief by Rick Riordan. Now, am I using this review partly as an excuse to show off my arc that I've had since I was like 12 years old? Yes. Yes, I am. So for those of you who don't know, The Lightning Thief is the first book in the Percy Jackson and the Olympians series, um, which is basically a fantasy adventure series that was first published in 2005 and follows the titular character Percy Jackson as he discovers that he is the son of the Greek god Poseidon and is thrust into the whole world of Greek mythology, but in a more modern setting. So he has to go on quests, um, save the world, save his mother, basically just try not to die as a, you know, young child, basically. So wanted to come back to this series and see whether or not it still holds up. After all, 2005 was a while ago. And so do these books still hold up? You know, are they actually, you know, still good? Are they actually as funny as I remember them being? Um, you know, is there a reason why people have been hyping these up, you know, especially with the Disney Plus series coming out, with the Chalice of the Gods having come out? Are the original books actually still good? To which the answer is, yeah. Yeah, they, could, they really are. I think one of the biggest things that struck me while rereading this was the fact that the just general writing quality was absolutely phenomenal. Um, especially when you compare it to maybe some other children's series that came out around this time, <coughs> Harry Potter. Um, it's phenomenal how good this writing actually is. Like, Rick Riordan has a style that he sticks with, he's consistent, and is just still manages to be very descriptive, and there's just a lot of heart in it throughout the entire story. Um, the other thing that honestly was also very surprising is just how well the humor holds up. Um, I'm a 31-year-old guy. Uh, I wouldn't necessarily expect to be laughing at all the jokes in a book meant for children. Um, and yet, despite that, um, my wife and I, while we were reading this, we both found ourselves laughing throughout the whole book. Um, Rick Gordon's humor manages to fit really well for both children and adults, and I think that's part of the reason why this book and the book series as a whole has remained so popular even you know, almost 20 years later at this point. So yeah, if you haven't already read Percy Jackson and the Olympians, I would highly, highly recommend that you do. It is a fantastic work of middle grade fiction that stands the test of time. It manages to blend in a lot of Greek mythology, uh, action-packed sequences, and just a genuine amount of heart into a really nice, fun adventure. 